All right, guys, Christmas is over and I am in the mood for some spooky. So we're gonna go in this giant Goodwill store right here and see what we can find in the DVDs. Oh my gosh, this place is packed today. Let's head straight back to the DVDs, see what kind of scary movies we can find. Oh, look at this, guys. I'm not really a big reader, but Hawaii's Best Spooky Tales. I just might have to get this. That looks cool. Bram Stoker's Dracula. Look at that. Just the art on that looks totally awesome. The Hardy Boys and the Haunted Fort. Look at the ghosty. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, here we go. R.L. Stein. Okay, I don't think that's what we're looking for, though. The Fear Street Saga. The Betrayal. Okay, skip that one. Night of Fear. Okay, here's another Fear Street R.L. Stein, the Sleepwalker. Uh, let's see. Maybe we'll find some goosebumps in here or something. Where are you, goosebumps? Night of the Living Worms. Look. <laughs> Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. Okay, Hatchet. Hmm, not sure what that one is. Might be about murder. Ghost of Crutchfield Hall. Let me know, guys, if you've read any of these. I, like I said, I don't read a lot of books, but these are usually like the spooky books that you read in junior high, and then they spook you for the rest of your life. You never forget them. Look, we got The Sixth Sense, Secrets from Beyond. We got Zombie Tales. Five stories of zombie invaders. One lock and key to keep your stories and your endings safe. Oh, I see. There must have been a lock on this book at some point, like when it was brand new. Haunted Museum, the Phantom Music Box. Really surprises me I haven't found any uh, Goosebumps books. There are usually a bunch of them in Goodwill stores. Let's move on to the DVDs, and the first one that I see is The Rats. Look at this. Holy crap, guys. The city's rat race just got deadly. Ooh. I don't think I've ever seen this. I don't recognize the names in there either, but dang, the rats. Heck yeah. Stay Alive. I think this is the video game one. Yeah, with uh, Frankie Muniz. This, I saw it, but it really wasn't all that great. Basically, it's like if you die in the game, you die in real life. Here's a Halloween-y one. Cat in a Hat Tricks and Treats. All right, can't go wrong with a spooky pumpkin. Look at this, the hills have eyes. Yes. I haven't seen this one for, actually I think this is the remake right here. Here's Sweeney Todd. I actually saw this at another Goodwill recently, which while I look around here, let's cut to that other footage because I did film some of the ones I found in that Goodwill. Ooh, a haunting in Georgia and a haunting in Connecticut. Mmm. Alright. Spider? What the heck is this? Sweeney Todd, the demon barber of Fleet Street. I have not seen this. Johnny Depp. I haven't seen this one either. The Vampire's Assistant. Oh, this is uh, John C. Riley. Final Destination 2. I like the first one best. When a Stranger Calls. This is, oh, this is the remake. Ooh, we got Stephen King's It. This is the original one. John Ritter is in this one. You gotta love Pennywise. The Devil's Rejects. I have not seen this one, and I don't know. I really am not interested in seeing it anyway. I'm not a big Rob Zombie fan when it comes to the movies. Okay, here's The Village, M. Night Shyamalan. This one was okay. I mean, his movies always have a twist ending. We got Wrong Turn. I think this is the one they're remaking right now. This was a pretty good one, actually. What is this? Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. Oh, it's an audiobook. I thought it was a DVD. I don't know what Hollow Creek is. Yeah, Burt Reynolds. That's not horror. That's probably just some suspense movie. Oh, but look, we got Stephen King's Sleepwalkers here. 
cool. I might have to get this one. Frailty was pretty good. It wasn't really horror. Um, I mean, it sort of is. Anytime you see somebody with an axe, it's pretty much horror. It is a good movie, though, but I think I already have it. Look at this. We got House of Wax. I think I saw this one. Hmm, I don't know. Okay, now this one, Blood Simple. There was a guy who just raved and raved about this. And I saw it, and I thought it was absolutely horrible. It's not a horror movie, it's just like a thriller. Oh, here we got a four film classic slashers. Oh, look, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, Nightmare on Elm Street, Friday the 13th, and Amusement? I've never heard of Amusement. What the heck is that? Huh, that's a pretty cool collection there, though, except for I don't really like that new Nightmare. I'm partial to the original Freddy. We got Urban Legends Final Cut. That's a good one. I remember seeing this one a long time ago. Warm Bodies. <laughs> I actually liked this one. Everybody's a zombie, basically, except for that girl. And she falls in love with this zombie boy. That's pretty cool. He reminds me of Gerard Way from My Chemical Romance. Oh look, here's Jekyll. We were just talking about the uh, Jekyll and Hyde audiobook up there. And this is a movie. Who in the heck is that? Hmm. Species 2. I honestly don't know if I've ever seen any of the Species movies. I should probably get this. Oh, here we go. Here's two of them right here. Pride, Prejudice, and Zombies. I passed that up before, but I might get that one. And The Descent. This is an awesome one right here, but I already own it. We got Final Destination 2 here. I am pretty sure I saw this one. I like the first one the best, though. Look at that cover. That's pretty cool. Ah, here we go. The Fog. Yes. Been a long time since I've seen this one, too. Jamie Lee Curtis is in this. Look, we got Hitchcock on Blu-ray. This is the, Miri, the movie about uh, Alfred Hitchcock. Anthony Hopkins, Helen Mirren. That would probably be a pretty interesting movie to watch. What in the world is this? Jolly Roger, Massacre at Cutter's Cove. He's back from hell to get his gold. <laughs> oh my god. That looks like it might be a fun one. Full screen, though. I'm not watching the full screen. Here we got another It. Oh look, we got When a Stranger Calls. I wonder if this is, yeah, this is the remake. I remember seeing the original one and it scared the crap out of me. Pet Cemetery Special Collector's Edition. That's cool. Been a long time since I've seen this one. Look, we got Amityville Horror. Awesome, long time since I've seen this one too. I need to revisit all of these. I need to just have a, a marathon horror night. Blair Witch Project. I really didn't like this one too much the first time I saw it, but then I watched it on VHS on the old CRT TVs where it actually looks how it should look if you're watching a video on VHS, and it scared the living crap out of me. Ooh, look guys, Black Christmas. How perfect is that right now? Look at this, we got a whole Wishmaster pack. Wishmaster 3. Wishmaster 1 and 2. So all three of these right here. Amityville Horror, the remake. This one is really good, actually. Shudder, this is one I haven't seen. Hmm. Hellion. Vower, look at this. Nobody I know in that, but that looks pretty creepy. Okay, that's not something I'd want to watch right there. Oh, look, guys. Well, we got Howl Howling 3 and Halloween, the original, 1978, Jamie Lee Curtis. Gotta love that one. Look at this, guys. We got a Stephen King 3-pack. The Langoliers, the Stand, and the Golden Years. I think the Langoliers is the one that Wally was looking for for a long time. I believe he finally found it. Four bucks for that. Look, we got Hostel. 
I honestly don't know if I've ever seen this movie, guys. I don't remember. I think it's something like the Saw movies. Last house on the left. Look at that, yes. Woo-wee! The Ring. This one scared the crap out of me, too. But it has to do with a VHS. So, yeah, on a regular TV there. So you probably would have to be old enough to understand the whole VHS thing for that one to be scary. Look at this, we got Halloween special. Bugs Bunny Halloween special. Bugs Gotta love the pumpkins. Ooh, Friday the 13th, the final chapter. Yes. Let's see the babysitter. And it's not really horror, but what is this? Kingdom Hospital, that's a Stephen King. Look at that. <laughs> There's another hostel. Uh, hmm. All right, guys, that's it. I took a walk around the store here to see if there was any other cool Halloween stuff in here anybody donated, but I do not see anything, so I'm out.